learning through our monthly uh, monthly series of on the growth path in collaboration with India Habitat Center. Today's lecture is on clearing negative influences through hypnotherapy by Ms. Blossom Fertito. Uh, I now invite Ms. Gora Dhamalal on stage to kindly give a brief introduction of LP to the audience and also welcome Ms. Blossom Fertito. But before that, a brief introduction of Ms. Lal, who has been associated with Life Positive for past many years. Gora Dhamalal is one of the esteemed members of our advisory board and well-known media personality. Ms. Lal has been freelancing with electronic media for more than 25 years, commentating, news reading to scripting, anchoring. She enjoys being involved in all these aspects of this versatile medium. Having gained varied experience in the field of education and managing of corporate affairs over the past 24 years, she is the founder and board member of Prava, an NGO that works in the area of active citizenship with young adults and also focuses on resource building of young social entrepreneurs. Her work with Prabha keeps her in touch with dynamic change makers and is enormously rewarding. However, above all that she does, Ms. Lan has always seen herself as a seeker to understand, accept and celebrate what life has to offer. I now request Ms. Lan to please take the mic and uh, introduce LP. Thank you, Punya. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It's a pleasure, a life positive, to welcome all of you to another one of our lectures. The series is On the Growth Path, which is a series of talks which unlock the potential in the human being, body, mind, and soul. And this is the trinity that Life Positive has always worked with. For those of you who may not be too familiar with Life Positive, a brief introduction. Life Positive mission has always been to create awareness of a new way of life and to shine light on the possibility of building a world based on the values of oneness. A world where the brotherhood of man and women is more than just a slogan and where all of us are invested in focusing on the larger good. A world of peace, love and harmony and of course such a world is not just a reality. But we believe that each one of us, we can create a world like this within ourselves and then around us and then we become the world. This is what the Life Positive magazine has been doing month after month, year after year for over 17 years, disseminating a non-sectarian, holistic perspective that supports us to connect with ourselves, with our fellow human beings and with the universe at large through articles that throw light in holistic ways to heal ourselves physically, mentally, and emotionally, through interviews with enlightened souls all over the world, through insightful articles on the wisdom traditions of the world, through narratives on the journey of individual seekers. We give the readers wholesome and nourishing fare that inspires them and us to move onward to the great human journey of self-transformation. Over the years, Life Positive has tried to move on to different milestones whereby we ourselves have grown. In June 2004, the group launched its second publication, Life Positive Hindi. In December 2005 came the Life Positive Expo, and which is now held in different locations uh, across India. Our books division, Life Positive Publications, has taken wings this year, and you can expect some wonderful books coming your way. Details of our publications are outside on the desk. You may take them through there. So Life Positive is growing, moving, changing, apt indeed for a magazine that has dedicated itself to growth, individual and collective our growth. As a part of this process of growth, we have given you feedback forms those of you who have not, please take it from any one of them who looks sufficient enough to be belonging to Life Positive. I think Vijay is right there. Your feedback is valuable to us because that will help us construct this series and your readers of the magazine, we welcome feedback about our books, about our magazine, about anything that we do. We're open to feedback, we invite feedback, and for us, in today's world, if feedback is given, it means somebody is listening, and we are happy to have you listen. 